Hey, welcome back. I hope everybody is having a great Friday. And thank you so much for joining me talking all things Masters of the Universe. Today, I'm sorry, guys, we're going to be continuing our look at every version of Triclops that I have in the collection. Of course, from the Masters line, the CGI line, and Funko Pop, and Classics as well. Now, part one, um, we looked at the Vintage version of Triclops and the Origins version of Triclops that have come out so far. All right. Now, of course, if you are new to my channel or first time watching, I hope you will subscribe afterwards. I hope everyone hits that like button, and thank you so much for doing that. Hit that notification bell when you upload new videos, and please share this video with who has a passion and a love for collecting all things Masters of the Universe. Without further ado, let's take a look at the rest of Triclops, okay? And first, thanks to Pixel Dan and Dark Horse Comics, we'll take a look at his, his classics version of Triclops. So here he is, Triclops, came out in 2009. There he is, really, really cool, with that same really cool robot right there, his vintage sword right there. Also, you can see that power ring that we just saw in that mini comic book version on the Origins line, that fan voting winner right there. There's all the uh, these eye pieces right there. There he is, front to back, side to side. Very cool. Of course, the classic line also, or the Super 7 line, I would say, hang on, also had the, this, now this is the version of Triclops that I want to see in the cartoon collection, the more uh, filmation style of Triclops in the Origins line. This is the one I'm looking forward to getting in the collection here. This is going to be an amazing, amazing version of Triclops with his ventured sword right there, his blaster, there he is in the packaging. Came out in 2018, right there. So there he is. Very, very cool. Awesome. Little, little intention here. All right. Very cool. All right. Now moving on to the my first version of Triclops, which is part of the Revelation line or show. Uh, is right here. Here is the packaging right here, the deluxe packaging of, of Triclops. So he came with um, two looks, of course his standard uh, look right there. So there he is. And then he became that cult leader in, for the motherboard. So I, um, so there's the, his extra head right there, the, the um, dress, or not dress, um, the um, outfit. Comes with extra pairs of hands, you know, a soft, good outfit right there. Cape. He's right here. Let me show you. Hang on. Show me right here. So there he is. Part of that leader of that cult uh, for the motherboard. As you know, in the Revelation show, once magic was pretty much destroyed, um, technology probably took over um, in the world of Eternia. Um, making, you know, like Triclops and Trapjaw, you know, you know, uh, leaders of, of this major, major cult. Uh, from Motherboard, which would turn out to be part of the Horde, okay? But there he is. Very cool version of Triclops. Soft, like I said, a soft good robe, beautiful cape, um, uh, really cool eyepiece right here with a big old helmet right here, his ventured sword right there. Everything absolutely amazing. But I still love this look too, the standard look of Triclops. Looks, looks amazing as well, all right? Comes with extra pairs of hands. Very, very cool. All right, now look in the back of it, you can see some absolutely amazing, beautiful artwork right there of Triclops. So there he is. Of course, the cross cell of the other, of the other figures and the wave here. But I do need to buy me a second version of this of this amazing. Oh, and look at this. I'm sorry. And this gorgeous, go real fast. This gorgeous artwork on the side here, beautiful. But I do need to pick up another uh, um, uh, mini deluxe figure of this, so I can have his standard look in the collection loose. I need to get that. All right. 
moving it right along, we just got this version of Triclops uh, not too long ago, which is his new Eternia version right here. So here he is, right there. Of course, you got the more updated packaging of the Masterverse uh, packaging right there. Beautiful uh, red uh, rocks blasting around right there. You got 30 points of articulation. You have the Mattel logo. And there's old Triclops right there with his green sword. And also you can notice the sash. You know, it's got the combination of both his vintage style and the mini comic book style. Um, with that sash right there with the little uh, like, uh, jewels, I guess. The orange and green and red right there. Comes with two swords. Looks absolutely amazing. Some absolutely gorgeous artwork as always. Right there in the front cover. We've got Master Universe, New Eternia. We've got some some orcs right there. I don't know if they're like battling about to battle him or he's he's in, in control of them, but very very cool. Got Triclops. I love the face sculpt. In fact, love there you go. Love the face sculpt. The detail looks absolutely amazing over the visor. Got the two harnesses that give you that you know that vintage style. Uh, like, um, of course, the vintage green sword, and this sword, it gives me more of that uh, filmation vibe with this uh, gold sword right here. Alright. Let's go ahead and look at the back of the packaging. Oh, of course, there's a side shot right there of old Triclops. Very, very cool. There he is. Beautiful artwork. Like I said before, I do like the fact that they're they're putting the, the actual figures in the artwork. I mean, that's really, really cool. There he is. A little, little bio of Triclops right there. All right. And like I said before, I, I'm looking forward to getting his his cartoon collection version, of course, his Turtles of Grayskull line, I'm hoping, and, you know, Thundercats, and many, many other versions of Triclops I would love to get. I would love to get a second go-around of that uh, fan voting winner version of Triclops uh, for my loose collection. All right, but there you go. All Right. And, of course, um, Triclops was a part of the CGI show, um, um, cartoon show. All right. So, here he is in the packaging. All right. Now, with this version of Triclops, um, this was a little different. Of course, this whole universe of the CGI show was very different from the standard line or, you know, what we've known and love about the Master of the Universe. With this universe, uh, the, this was an AI, okay? The visor right here. Look at the beautiful artwork once again. But this visor basically it was a it, um, an AI that would attach itself to anybody. I mean anybody, any Eternian. And once it did that, it took over their bodies, and so that became Triclops. Okay. So this uh, this was a artificial intelligence that would attach to a, an Eternian to make them become Triclops. So anybody could be you know Triclops in this universe. But there is the artwork right there, of the figure right there, the glamour shot. There's the Grey Skull from that world. You have Netflix. You have He-Man and the Master Universe CGI show logo. There he is. There's old Triclops right there. A very different take, a very different looking Triclops. Now, of course, they, he keeps that, that same you know look with the visor, but different take on the outfit, of course. Uh, no sword. He comes with it with a spear. Right there. Yeah, now he does keep that. He does have that 80 style uh, vintage uh, power attack, uh, uh, waist attack right there. We got Triclops right there. All right. In the back right there. And like you know, every version of Triclops, you can twist the visor to give you a different look right there for the eyepiece. There he is. All right. Of course, there's the other cross cell of these particular. We got 
Mesquita and uh, Skeletor. A, a very cool, different take. Is that like a, I think that's an, like an eagle, I think, on the chest. All right, very cool. All right, and finally, as you can see right here, I do have a Funko Pop. This is my my Tricops Funko Pop right here. So there he is. This was a limited edition from Funko Tricops. There's a glamour shot of him right there, and there is the figure right there. There is the side of the packaging, and then the back right there of the cross cell or the other. Uh, figures, Funko. All right, but there you go, guys. There's a look at all the Tricops in the Master of Universe, and I will. And I hope that you know, um, you know, like like I, like I said, um, this is my favorite figure of all time. Um, he was my first figure ever to have in this in this amazing amazing universe uh let me know in the comments below what's been your favorite version of triclops or what is or maybe let, let me know what's your favorite figure of all time you know what is the one that you really love the most all right or have a passion for and to collect in this amazing universe all right but there you go guys All right, guys, I'd like to take time now, of course, to thank my subscribers. Thank you so much for joining me today, guys. And don't forget to hit that notification bell once again. And tomorrow, I finally got my second version of uh, my my Sun Man 3-pack, the second version that came out, um, you know, about a couple months ago. I finally got it, and we'll be doing a full unboxing, finally, to get my loose collection. So I hope you will join me for that, I hope. All right, so I hope you guys have a great Friday. And I'll see you guys on Saturday. Take care and have a good one, everybody.